So do you have any questions at all? You're no, you're no, shooting. Oh no, I just I'm documenting. I think it's fascinating. You anything. You're dumb as you fuck. It is fascinating. That was you know, dude. That's ableist. Okay. It's just it's the common refrain when you don't have an argument to attack people personally. I don't know why you do that. These act you you activists don't always follow your own stuff though. You call me dumb and I didn't call you anything. I didn't call you I did. Dumb, dumb, this, that, and the other. So like what what if I do have a neurological disability of some kind? Dumb as fuck. I'll keep saying it. How do you know that? I don't care. That's the point. I don't know. I think a lot of people who came up, particularly boys who came up in the 90s, were drugged a lot. I don't notice, I don't notice feminists talking about that. <laughs> do you ever talk about that? Why, see, why is that just the only response you had to laugh at me and call me an idiot? I just said what? Yeah, so are you kidding me? That's all you could say. Can you, can you continue your point? I'd like to hear you speak That you de-emphasize... You, you de-emphasize men's rights issues. You attack people who advocate for men. I don't know. I don't give a shit what you say. Go away. Go away. Don't make assumptions. Go away. I will. Go away. Why are you here today? To document. To document the... The document the... Uh, <laughs> what rights don't men in dresses have? I would, you know, if they're to read the kids without having a protest the right about to not it. Being harassed by people like or you. Like, like, that's a, that's Wait, so you have a right to not be protested? I'm not aware of that. Yeah, they did say that. The right to not to read to a kid in a dress and not be protested. That's not a right. And I'm not even I'm not even protesting per se. I'm just fucking. I don't care what you want to say, and I don't want to ask you like, 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 a question. Yes. What you Why do you think we face? Uh, because there are some people on YouTube who like post uh, stuff about protests uh, to their alt right followers, and I'm not really alt right, dude. That's not that's that's another thought terminating cliche right there. <laughs> alt right is a thought terminating cliche. Oh, can you just like. Like, just like SJW, if I called you that, that would just be me saying I don't want to converse with you intellectually. No, or you're just alt right. I, I mean, it's pretty clear you I'm don't want to engage with us intellectually. Sure. Sure it is. Sure I am. It's just been you're dumb, you're dumb, you're dumb, you're dumb. I haven't really sat, I haven't really been conducting myself that way. I don't care about what you have to say. I can talk circles around you. I choose not to. You haven't been though, because there's no intellectual basis to defend this. Oh, I know who I am. Go away. It's fine. I have nothing to prove to you. I saw it. Yeah. Physically and in your heart. He knew about saw, dude. That is bigoted against the differently attractive. I'm getting my I'm getting my teeth worked on too. So an ugly heart. You have an ugly heart. Your energy is ugly. It's like fuck your racist grandma isn't ugly energy. If she's racist, if your granny's racist, well, ra I don't. Be <laughs> Again, it's a thought terminating cliche. Like, what is racist? And so that's not racist, but okay. Calling people racist frivolously is an uh, increasingly common thing. There's nothing frivolous about it if they are racist. Nine times out of ten, it is, in my opinion. You can prove it. I, that's why I asserted it's my opinion. Yeah, we don't care about your opinion. Go away. She just asked me about my opinion. She asked me about it. But we don't actually have to I want more than just your well, okay. clips Dude. of words that you think are... So that's not a violation of consent or anything right there? Oh, yeah, as soon as he's called out on it. Do these people consent to seeing that? I don't need to see your ass. Exactly, there you go. We don't need to see your unwiped asshole, dude. So anyway. about his asshole? You're dumb. Go away. It's a joke. Um, your jokes are not funny. Your face is. Go home. <laughs> Listen, Rosie the Riveter, why don't you call him the fuck down? I don't have to listen to you. Go home. Oh, and you're being sorry. You're dumb. Go home. Rosie that's all I have to say. I'll keep saying it. Go so home. we are at this event. We're sexualizing kids. You're and the you're the Nothing only one saying it. This is sexualizing children. Nothing so you don't think, no, if you wanted an example for your earlier we question. We don't. Yeah. Go home. 
Do you remember the, the whole Covington thing? Like, would you say that they were racist because they were standing there smirking? You don't know about that? No. <laughs> Basically, there's a bunch of white kids standing there smirking with a Trump hat on, getting a yeah. drum beaten in their face, and the well, media, well, like, no. threatened them yeah. and cast them as oh, a bunch yeah, of Klan yeah, members. And, okay, I do know what you're talking about. And so, video? don't you think that that is an example of the institution well, of the media fucking with a bunch of white kids? No. You don't think so? I don't, I don't think so. You don't think so? Even though, even though tautologically, that's literally what that was. Yeah, it was. There's no way you can disagree with that. You don't. You don't. You don't. I don't what? You have any idea what Native Americans have gone through? You don't. What does that have to do with what we're talking about? Because you just brought up the event. So they can just beat a fucking drum in this dude's face for no reason? Yes, they can. Heritage. You don't find that to be a violation of consent or anything like that? Personal space? Bubble? Public space? Did they physically assault them? No. I'm saying... Okay. You're the one that just said that you don't have a right to not be protested. So how is that working out? It's a violation of the kid's personal space, though. Like particularly what he did. No, but, what's your name? So you don't think it was? You don't think that the media ganging up on those kids and threatening them was like using the apparatus of the media to falsely characterize them as like Nazis and stuff? There was no falsified information <laughs> that they were a bunch of. That they were harassing the native guy? Like what? Like what? Like what? So, wearing a MAGA hat in public? Wearing a MAGA hat in public is grounds to be threatened and harassed as a racist? Yeah, there was. Their school was threatened. They were threatened. Hey, you got a MAGA hat? What's it? I personally do not know. Really? Is he threatening me on camera, dude? You look like a member of a ska band. Shut the fuck up. Oh! That's a bad idea. Why? You do look like you're in a ska band. Whatever, dude. Are you Yes. I don't. What? I don't know. What? Would you give free health care to uh, Martians? Is that what you're trying to get to? Oh, okay, the Alex Jones meme from 2013. Gotcha. Okay. See, the left cannot meme, and this is video evidence of it. Um, <laughs> you reptilian. <laughs> frogs gay. Oh, the freaking frogs are gay. Oh, Alex Jones memes from 2014. Gotcha. Okay. The frogs are gay. Okay, okay. Get it out. Get it out. Stuck a potato up your. No. I can climb up it. Is it still there? No. What's wrong with you? No. Before or after. I think that perhaps your mind is so open that your brain is falling out. I think that's your problem. What brought you? To check it out because this is are you serious? This is this is a very a regular event. This is you know, this is new. This is well there's one of you and about 100, 200 of these people. So and what do you think? What's the point of saying that? Is that like vaguely threatening or is that a vague threat? No, it's just putting it in perspective. Of what? What's the perspective? What do you mean? Like they're right because they have a hundred people and I'm wrong because I'm one person? What do you mean? So what? <laughs> well, your white people have been, been indoctrinated into hating your white skin and your male genitalia. I know that much. <laughs> Or something intrinsically like toxic. You're really dumbfounded by your ignorance, right? Really? You are in a ska band! Shut up! But you're in a ska band. Being in a ska band. <laughs> You've been standing here for the past like what half hour saying that though. You've been standing there for the past half hour saying that. I will stay here. Incel? Next you're going to say fedora tip. <laughs> I'll, I'll be here the left is physically incapable of memeing. Yeah. They're 
and that, you know, that, that goes to the original point. Why does the left have to sexualize everything? They're calling me an incel, raising questions about my sexuality. Why is everything that the left says grounded in sex in some way? Why do you say that? Because she calls me an incel, and that's like a common refrain from the left. No so, so that's sexualizing everything. I personally, yes. People don't. Are you an incel? What does that have to do with the conversation at home? You brought it up to this presentation. I don't know. I don't know. There's like eight million questions being fired at me at once. My. Well, and you can't see the hands of someone. So no one understands you. No one. So I'm marginalized. Am I marginalized? No. No. You're not. You're not marginalized. At all. Okay. That's an opinion. That's an opinion. I don't know if I am or not. I buy. It. I, I really don't see. I don't see if. I don't see how. Uh, you're not gonna let me answer a single fucking question. Because she'll ask a question, then eight other questions follow, and I can't. Do you think that white people can? You won't let me answer the question. You won't let me answer the question, Grandma. Days of Our Lives is coming on soon. You might want to go tape it. I don't think the right can be. Let's talk about that. Let's talk about getting on the treadmill for a second. So are you marginalized? So is this, is this like uh, fat people are marginalized, like healthy in any size? Is that your contention? Oh, I'm asking you because we like marginalized. Yeah. You're so respectful. Yeah. Probably because I heard a lot What do you mean? I didn't even hear you. I don't think it is. I think this needs to be documented, especially if the uh, Christians show up, which I don't think they are. I, I would struggle to say that most people in America are oppressed. I would, I would struggle to say that. Calling me nuts is not an argument. Calling me dumb or an incel is not an argument. Calling them Yes, it's a, it's a scientific fact that I'm an asshole. Okay. No, you made it a fact yourself, but you're doing this all the time. You have a reputation. People know you. Documenting insane leftist protests is bad because why? Well, I, because sunlight is the best disinfectant, buddy. That's why. That's why. This is a protest. This is a story time for children. No, no, it was billed as a protest against the Christian group that didn't even show up. <laughs> no, it was billed as story time. It was a counter protest no. against the Christians who haven't even shown up. No, it's a story what do you mean? Time. Fire, uh, fire, garbage fire, or whatever the fuck it's called. That's what it was advertised as. You want to set me on fire? I'd like to see you set on fire. That'd be okay. You represent the garbage, and there could be a fire. <laughs> you know, that's, I, I, thought, I thought that was a plan where it's like, there could be a garbage fire. That'd be funny. You want to set me on fire? I never said that. Did I, you can report that. I didn't say that. You can watch it back. There could be a garbage fire, and there might be some garbage it, though, to make it look like, yeah. Well, that's fine. I don't care. Oy vey. But I'm a I'm a good goyim who hates his white skin and his and his male uh, anatomy. Why would you set me on fire? I wouldn't set anybody on fire. That's cool. <laughs> a white a white majority is racist. That's true. You agree with that? White majority. That's not, that's so not whites a, existing a whites existing is is racist and bad and needs to be corrected. So whites existing is bad. Of course not. They exist. Whites being the majority is bad. I see more white people here. They're existing and they're they're. But isn't that problematic? Shouldn't there be more POC here? Isn't it? Ra isn't this event racist? I can't see that. Isn't this event mostly white and therefore racist? No. That's no. Racist. It's not some boutique bourgeois fucking like ivory tower I think most bullshit. Here are kind of on a lower income bracket. They're not really bourgeois, you know. No, sitting around in academia, whinging about your fuck, like labia gazing about your fucking identity and your your uh, gender. That is the most boutique bourgeois ivory tower. Power activity I could even think of. I think so. Yeah, it is, dude. That is the most first world bourgeois activity I can possibly think of. Yeah. Sitting around like pontificating about your identity, that's the most, that's gotta be the most like first world fucking shit ever. Hey, 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 and all the corporations agree with you guys, by the way. They're all flying the pride flag. Hey, can I see you just see a pride flag on me? All of the corporations are doing that, though, is what I'm saying. Can I see something, though? 
What's I'm sure. Breakfast today? I'm sure it'll be completely in good faith. What's having breakfast today? I just want to know. Coffee. Kellogg's corn just coffee. Flakes. Black yeah. coffee. Actually, no coffee with a lot of white you cream in it. You got black coffee, right? No, I actually put a lot of white <laughs> cream in it. <laughs> Do it see you at, at 1 p.m. on an empty stomach with nothing but a cup of coffee. That's why your panties aren't yeah, yeah. You should at least put some milk in the coffee. You're telling me you're probably calories, upset. Dude. Upset? You tell me you're probably yeah. real upset right That's now. That's why it's swollen a little. Why you call? Why you, that was a body you, shaming microaggression right there, buddy. You want a macro aggression? I got some milk sauce. You want some milk sauce in the car? You want some milk sauce? Is who hurt you coming next? Do you want do you who want hurt you? you? Do you want some alcohol sauce? Directly next to you. I'm just I'm concerned. I see the way you're conducting yourself. And it concerns me. That's all. I'm just I'm concerned. You are attending a drag queen story hour. <laughs> actually, I was already gonna be here today. I actually stand by this fence every Sunday between 11 and 1. So I, I was going to be here. So yeah, I decided it's to stay really strong. Great yeah, that's you know, it's, 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 it's great. It's cool here. It's, it's like 10 degrees cooler than the And the propagandizing of kids this part of the is something that we still haven't been able to talk about. So, teaching kids? I like to watch. Propagandizing and indoctrinating them. Like, Why do you you know, that was what happened before we got in the way. That was propagandizing and indoctrinizing was what happened until people started speaking out. So people not talking about drag queens deconstructing whiteness and maleness. The lack of that is propagandizing. Right, not let it be expressed. So the lack of sexualizing kids is asserting asserting that little kids have. That's what you guys are doing. You're asserting you're asserting that kids can be trans or gay. How is that sexualizing? 